We're gonna be talking a little bit more about security today and who I have with me is Brian Kane from Ghost. Brian, tell us a little bit about Ghost, what it is, what it does, uh, yeah. what is this cool stuff? So uh, Ghost uh, started in 2005. We're a maritime security, tracking, monitoring, video surveillance, acoustic deterrent and cloaking technology company. We do everything from boats from 20 feet to 300 feet uh, for complete peace of mind for the owner. Uh, whether it's video extraction so they can see who's on the boat, calling them if the boat's taking on water, text messaging them if the boat's got a battery issue, uh, or someone's breaking into it. And particularly uh, with the uh, I'm Logan at boat, we have the Nav Tracker 1.0, which is a global satellite tracking system, which tells latitude, longitude, speed, and direction 24 seven of the boat, wherever it goes. So in layman's terms, you guys are the low jack of, of boats, pretty much. And my dad opted to get a ghost unit put on his uh, CB whenever he was getting his electronics package put in. But we didn't show it going in. We didn't really talk a whole lot about it because we had to keep it secret. We didn't want to show where it is. And, and we're going to have to do that again on this boat. But tell us a little bit about how that process works. What do you guys look for when putting one in? Well, you know, you can uh, hide this pretty pretty easily on a boat. You just generally don't want to put it on, on, on a T-top because they usually, it, when boats are getting stolen, oftentimes they'll, they'll cut the T-top right off to get a, uh, less weight on the boat when they're doing certain uh, nefarious things when they're using the boat. Uh, we really just like to bury it underneath the fiberglass in a discreet location. As long as there's no metal cleats or bow railings above it or carbon fiber, we're good. We, we can penetrate fiberglass no problem. Okay, awesome. And for a real world situation, you guys had a situation come up a couple of days ago where you were able to recover somebody's boat. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, we had a, a client of ours that had a, a 100 foot west ship that was towing a 35 foot Everglades back from the Bahamas, 25 miles east of Miami, like five in the morning when they're doing the tow, the tow line broke and conditions were just too dangerous to warrant trying to get it back at that time. So they let it drift and they, they clicked the mouse and uh, we, we worked with them as well and uh, we set up a five minute track and for the next 20 miles we watched it do a two knot drift all the way to North Lauderdale and the, they, they contracted a local towing company and they zoomed in right on it and that tow company said without the tracker there's no way we would have found this wow. boat. Wow and that would, have, that would have been a half million dollar salvage job right there for you know Boat US or something yep. like that. Well we are going to put one of these units in this boat we're not going to be able to show it uh, but we are going to use this technology to one protect the boat and two you guys are gonna be able to track it as it goes to different shows, as it goes to different people's shops and has more work done on it. You're gonna be able to see in a live real time where the boat is and what's being done to it. How are they gonna be able to do that? So you just wanna to go to your Apple or your Android store and just download Ghost Tracker, that's G-O-S-T Tracker. You'll see it right there below your screen. And uh, the login credentials are right there as well. And enter that information and you'll see exactly where this boat behind us is at any given time. And you can even ping it if you want to find out uh, if it's, uh, hasn't updated in a couple minutes you can ping it and find out where it is right now and if somebody wants to go get a ghost unit on their boat see what it's going to take to do that kind of stuff where are they going to go uh, you just want to go to do, uh, www.ghostglobal.com to see our complete line awesome brian thank right. you so much but we'll take a quick time out